All right, peeps. Welcome back. More daily duels. Today is Thursday. That means you're using Burning Abyss. So let's click some butt with Burning Abyss real quick. This deck is still really good in my opinion. Anyway, this hand is eh. this hand is real. Uh, at this point, I pretty much say this hand is not. Right. So I'm gonna create Bennett, Brother, search for. I'm gonna get it. Uh, you plan on sending something? That's a Shadals. Well, there goes. Oh, never mind. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Weird. What? Hello? Alright, you're gonna grab your broke snatch. Got that. Hello? <laughs> the fuck with this fucking deck? Black. Graveyard, graveyard, gray. A lot of graveyard based shit. A lot of, lot of, lot of graveyard based shit. I thought Blackwing been I'm like, no, I see you guys as well. No, no, no. Okay. Uh, I'm thinking about just going. Uh, the problem is if he takes my Dante. That's the, I think that's the problem. Think about just summoning Farfa and just poking you. Uh, you know what? I don't mind if Farfa's in the graveyard. Got a lot of protection shit. You want to use your hook and curry bandit to block my thing? So go ahead and do that? Sure. It's only a thousand. So I'll just go ahead and just permanently just remove and play your curry bandit. So. There goes your uh, light targets, and at least no BLS, right? Anyway. Uh, good news is I finally got in contact with Mega Capital G, so you know, I sent them the video, so hopefully I'll be getting that guest upload soon. I am really looking forward to it, because I would love a guest upload. Alright, and yeah, grab yourself another arm again tonight. Someone arm again tonight. You know what? I'm going to Divine Wrath you. The reason why I'm gonna divine wrath you is because a I don't want you to get any more effects and b I really don't want you to kill my my farfa because I don't want your farfa to affect the banshee and then you come back to the field so you know what I'll go ahead and divine wrath you because I want to go ahead and get good and evil in the burning abyss to the graveyard anyway so you could just die and then here goes your normal summon and these crane cranes all right I think good and evil in the burning abyss. I'll go ahead and pitch rubric, and uh, I mean, I guess I'll go ahead and get like, like a, like a sir or something, Skarm? Yeah, Skarm sounds fine. <sighs> Working on my education homework. Sometimes, sometimes there's like no work from that class, and you know, sometimes I just completely forget that I even have that class, and other times I'm like, this is a lot of shit to do. <laughs> a lot of shit to do for my education class. So, once every blue moon in that class, she's like, hey, you gotta do this project. And it's just like, oh. Wow, that was a really, really great mill. Really great mill. Do I want far hunt? No. Do I want graph? Sure. And then I, and I milled another good nibble in the burning abyss, too. Whew. Whew. Bitch, you guessed it. That was a good mill. Alright, about to shave off like half your life points, unless you have more of your hand traps. I saw a Swiss Scarecrow, so I'm assuming that you're running cards that, and you got an angry right now. Never mind, I'm not going to get this much damage in. I'm going to get damage in, it's just not going to be you know, as much as I would like it to be. So it's pretty, it was pretty much part two of this part one assignment that I'm doing on my friend. Uh, it's like education psychology, so I'm like analyzing his psychological, him psychologically. He's like, ooh, I really don't care. Well, that sucks, so, because he blocked my attack, Dante stays in attack mode. Uh, uh, I'm trying to think what I want to do. I might have to just leave it like that. Yeah, I might have to just leave it like that. You know, I was, I was thinking about, you know, uh, maybe like going like put it the you know the down magician and then this would die and this would summon, but then it just wouldn't be worth the trouble. Like fuck it, if you kill my Dante, you kill my Dante. Okay, I can I can always summon another one. You can have that one when I'm mad at. You want my fucking Dante? Take it. I will use Sparkle though. Another problem is I think that once you're banished, I think you come back to his side of the field, which sucks. Oh, you're just gonna screw it up, but you were gonna get my Dante back. Ah. <sighs> 
Because I think I did that before. Farfell banished the monster Koopa Snatch Tail, and they got it back, and then that sucked. So, you know what? It's time to get another duel in. Be right back. Alright, back with another one. So, usually it's like one quiz, no, like week by week, it's like a quiz, no work, a quiz, no work. This was like no work. This week it was like quiz. It was like quiz for chapter four, midterm, project, discussion. I was like, holy shit. Damn, he's just saying he ain't fucking around. He's just gonna go straight into Dark Law. Say, hey, you can't use Dark Law. That's my card. <laughs> Hello? It's the first time Dark Law, though. I'm probably not gonna do much. I'm probably just gonna take it slow. No, oh, I can go into Dark Law. <laughs> Like, you like to go into Dark Law? Nah, nigga, I have Dark Law. I am bringing this, and I have the power. Nah, I'm probably just gonna take a slow. Just set this, set this, and then Phoenix Wing Wing blast your ass. Yeah. Since finding me. I'll pitch the Farfa. Got that in phase of Misty or something? <laughs> so you're gonna send or you're gonna search for a poly? You're gonna search for a poly. Uh, so I can't I can't fucking stop that. Poly. Uh Yeah, well then use that. Let your poly just fizzle. Yeah, you can go back to that shack. You want to go ahead and use them? See, I was going to get rid of the, the vanities anyway. So you want to go ahead and poly? Go ahead. Absolute zero? Absolutely. That's absolutely fine. <laughs> Me for twenty five, sure. No, oh, and then you want to change into acid too. Oh, this is going to be more of an inconvenience. I mean, he said he's completely out of resources, but. I know, I don't really have a way of getting around that. I can summon like, like Zen Mings or something. I can summon you, but you would start taking a toll on me. Oh, my monster effect gets activated, period. I can always kill you. Yeah, I could kill you. Yeah, I can summon you, summon, go into Acid Golem. When do I detach? During your center phase, okay, I can detach, then search for Skarm. Yeah, I'll do that. I'm going to Acid Golem, why not? I'm already up on resources, so there's totally nothing wrong with me, you know, being up. And then when I'm good and ready, I'll just go ahead and kill the Acid Golem. So next turn, uh, during my stamina phase, I'll go ahead and uh, detach the the Skarm, and then the turn after that, I'll probably kill you. Now I get a couple shots in before this card's an absolute problem. Nope. Yes. Skarm. Ah, nothing I really want to do this turn besides just poke you. 
So uh, I took the the midterm review. Most of the answers I find online, like usual. Some one, some one of them, it was the wrong answer. It's like what the fuck, you know? One of them was just like, what the living fuck? Like why, why is this the wrong answer? Sure. But uh, uh, you get unlimited retries. Like literally, I searched the thing online and it was like, and it, it had like two parts. The first part. <laughs> Okay. The first part, it, it was like two parts. It was like two part. And it was like positive reaction, negative reaction, and then other shit. So I, I, I Google search the answer, and then all the, all the places that I look say negative reaction, negative reaction, or negative reaction. I'm like, oh, okay. So the answer is, you know, negative reaction. You know, and three out of the four answers have negative reaction. So I try the first one wrong. I'm going to go ahead and uh, kill you now. Because you are totally in my way. Uh, okay, let me do this right. So I'm gonna discard you. He's all like, you're gonna divine wrath, you're a monster. Like, I don't need him anymore. He's in my way. So, sir, go ahead and come and scarm. Go ahead and number someone graph. XC into the Dante. Got that fire lick, too. Just ground. Only three. One, two, three. Sure. Go ahead and summon me another sir. What's the stats on uh, Blazeman? 1800 defense. Damn. I did not know he had that booty. I'll go ahead and just kill it then. And then poke him for 16. Then I'll set the fire lake and uh, end my turn. So, uh, that, all the answers were saying, all right, so you might as well scoop it up, and I'll go ahead and uh, get another duel win. Bear back. All right. So, all of them said negative, 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 negative. There was three out of the four answers that had negative, so I tried the first one. Wrong. Get to do it again. Tried another one. Wrong. Do it again. Tried another one. Wrong. I was like, what the fuck is going on here? I was like, is it the positive one? It was the positive one. I'm like, what the fuck? How is it the positive one? Like, hello? Hello? <laughs> uh, I'm going to special summon Kagna. Normal summon Graph. Go into Dante. Dante, 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 Dante. Is that all you care about is Dante? What I put you in attack mode? Because I'm bad. I'm so used to being able to attack with him. Oops. One, two, three. Graph. Yes, grab someone, me, sir. So bad, so bad. Cause I can't attack first turn, so Dante's just gonna go back to one thousand one hundred. Like that sucks. I'm bad. I mean, one thousand. Why I say one thousand one hundred? Why I get the one hundred from one thousand? Just right back down. So should have summoned you in D. So literally, all my opponent has to do is summon a burning abyss monster and attack. Over my Dante. I was bad. I'm an idiot. Tower Knights. Oh, heroics. Maybe I can get a little bit of bang out of my buck for my fire lake. I mean, I can always fire lake them, that's the thing. Goldfish. No, that's fine. What do you do? I'm gonna fire lake right now. Now would be a good time to go ahead and fire lake. You already committed to your normal summon, you've already overextended, you've already done your play. Yeah, all of your effects. Sir, go ahead and summon me Dante. Dante, go ahead and grab me back Fire Lake. Cagna, go ahead and drop me good and evil. God, Burning Bis, you're so strong. Literally, I can just go, alright, summon Skarm, and fire like his ass again. I got these turret guns, I don't even really want to use them. Yeah, you know what, I'll, I'll use Good and Evil. Pitch you, search for Burning Abyss. Probably get me another. 
Threatening Roar. All right. Uh, uh, who do I want? Yeah, I'll give me a nose, sir. Ah, Burning Miss. This deck is so strong and so handsome. <laughs> Hope that's MST, because I can fire like your ass again. Scarm, sure. Uh, this point. Don't give me graph. At this point, it really doesn't matter, but sure. I don't need another tour guide. I already have two, so. And I'm even using tour guide. See? Even if tour guide gets hit to two, this deck would still be good. Mm-hmm. Now you summon your other monster, and then I'll fire like you, and then that will be pretty much the end of the duel. GG. See, I knew I shouldn't have talked. You, give me back you. You, give me back you. Summon the grab. Fire like you again. Fire like you again. Fire like you again. Like, this deck is fucking crazy. I'm done any damage to him, but I'm sure up on the resources, aren't I? My opponent does not want to quit. <laughs> My opponent's like, I ain't no quitter. Like, alright. Yeah, at this point, do I even need to fire like your ass again? Sure, I'll use Crane Crane this time. Crane Crane, go ahead and summon me, sir. Go into another Dante. You got another Threatening Roar? Bottomless. Bottomless. No. Turn to him? I have no idea what it is. It's something. Something. I'm waiting on him. All right. Oh, maybe it was bottomless. I think it might be bottomless, but I guess he just didn't want to activate it. One, two, three. Sir, sure. Why but no? This. Ah, uh, sure. I'll summon Kagna. So up. So up, so good. Bottomless. It's bottomless. Bottomless me. There you go. I knew it was bottomless. I didn't turn my other down to attack mode. Oops. <laughs> even even if I fuck up, I'm still so good. Bet you can't get through this face down is. Ah, I don't need to activate it now. I'm so fucking good. Sure. Let me wait three more. No, no Farfa. Ah, Burning Abyss. How, how do they ever say you're not one of the strongest decks? I don't know. You're so fucking good. I'm so in control. So in control. Go ahead. So, finally I got the right answer. Like I said, you get to retry over and over and over and over again, so that wasn't even the freaking problem. And then not only did I have to take the, the midterm test, but I also had to take the chapter four quiz. Chapter four quiz was only nine questions instead of ten, but it was a little bit more difficult just because uh, I couldn't find some of the answers. Like some of the answers I re like usually I Google search it and they were like, hey, look, flashcards. Here's the question, here's the answer. So I was like, all right, there's the answer. Some of these questions I really had to like look for the damn answers. I was like, all right, all right. Time to look and actually look. Whew. But I pulled it off. I did. I pulled it off. I got 100% on the first one. These quizzes aren't even worth much. Like, literally, the quizzes are worth, like, one point. The assignment, the project I had to do is, like, ten. Like, I, it's not even the same fucking ballpark. Okay, I guess you want a Goblinberg because you want a Goblinberg? I mean, Goblinberg ain't nothing without his companion. All right, some Goblinberg, that's fine. Was this like a call the hunter or something? No, you're just gonna fucking do it just to do it. Alright, you know what? Fire like you one last time for the road. Let me just leave you with nothing. Yep. Alright, well, that's it for dueling. Let me just go ahead and finish talking about you know, my online classwork. <laughs> ah, so, 
That had to do that. What else to do? I have to take the, the survey. If you wanted to do the survey, you get easy two points. You know, so literally, you get two points for just a survey. Quizzes are worth one. Like, the, look at that. Look at it. Just survey your opinion. Two points. Quiz only one. <laughs> only one. So the survey was pretty much like, oh, uh, I lost the midterm because apparently someone hacked it. Like, someone hacked. Like, hello, okay. So she's like, do you want to have a midterm? You know, during uh. Look, look, look how stupid this question is. Like, do you want to have a midterm during spring break or no midterm and then have the final be worth more points? Like, fuck the midterm. <laughs> so I said, no, no, no midterm. Final worth more points. And then the second question was like, do you want an essay final exam? Or, oh, 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 and the midterm wasn't even multiple choice. It was an essay. Like, no, no midterm. Put on the, more in the final. And then the second question is like, do you want an essay final or a multiple choice final? What kind of fucking question is that, lady? <laughs> multiple choice. Hell yeah. Fuck, fuck, fuck essays. All right, no. So, got two points for that. My project was a little bit more difficult than the first one, but it was still okay. I got the majority of it finished, but then the, this part, she was like, oh, you know, reference from the book for this part. And I was like, where do I find this book where, you know, where you want me to reference from? You know, this book is thick as fuck. And I was like, oh my god, I don't even know how the fuck I'm going to do this. So... She has, like, a just discussion forum where she has all the students discuss something. Pretty much you put, you know, uh, what you learned and you respond to the student. So I was like, I was like, please have someone who knows, who knows what to do on it. And then there's this one student. And they're like, you can find this on page this, this on page this, this on page this. I'm like, you are a godsend. So I went, flipped up my book, and I just finished off that project. So uh, Thursday being tomorrow, since I'm close a day ahead, I literally have to just take my project, slap it down at the, the writing center so they can just check it for you know corrections just so i can have proof and turn it in and then i have another week of nothing then a week where i have a quiz and another week of nothing and then i work on my final project which is worth like the the big chunk of my grade which pretty much i just take both the two papers and then just smash it into one essay Ooh, okay so yep that's it what else anything else i got some of the Yu-Gi-Oh cards i got some of the Yu-Gi-Oh cards for the Teller Knight deck in my e-bell deck so i'll be you know hopefully have them all and i can make my uh my uh, real life decks for more live videos soon. Uh, Rennie took my cell phone. <laughs> he did. He was like, Can I see your cell phone? I'm like, Sure. And then he never gave it back to me, so I'm cell phoneless right now. <laughs> Tear. <laughs> uh, I'll get it from him. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe like Friday or Saturday. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call this episode. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Vimal. Uh, hello? This isn't Vimal Y. This is Daily Duels. Sorry. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Burning Abyss is still so strong. And I will see you guys tomorrow with, uh, was that Volcanics? Yeah. Alright, people. Thanks for watching.